Yo, what's going on everyone? It's D. Lloyd. So ESPN's Brian Winhorsey is reporting today that it looks like Kevin Love could miss as much as a month with that left toe injury that he sustained last week. And this is definitely going to go into the hands of what I've been saying. We know, of course, Ty Lue, he was fired as head coach. Larry Drew was in there temporarily. He says he doesn't want to take the interim tag unless he has a contract that could extend for multiple seasons past the 2018-19 year. So it looks like for Cleveland, they're in a tough spot. They're not going to have Kevin Love, who is their go-to and their star player currently. And you really don't have a coach. Like I said, Larry Drew is only there temporarily right now until they find a replacement. I made a video a while back saying how a lot of people around the league, including myself, feel that Kevin Love will be traded before the trade deadline. When you take a look at Kevin Love's contract, it's actually a descending deal in his final season. His last year of that extension, he will actually make less money than he does the years prior, which means a team may take the opportunity to trade for a player like Kevin Love, especially if they think Kevin Love can help them win now or in the near future for Cleveland. I don't know why they had this assumption that they will still be a playoff team without LeBron James. They built their team as if they were fully expecting to compete to make the playoffs. Right now, they're sitting with an 0-6 record. Right now, they are the only winless team in the NBA. And when you watch them, they look like the worst team in the NBA currently. Now, of course, things can possibly change with the coaching change. But realistically, when you take a look at this roster, it's depleted. You need to blow it up. You need to start over. You need to get younger. You need to do a lot of things. Kevin Love, I think, still is going to be one of the major dominoes. I think he will be traded before the trade deadline. Even if it is for draft picks, you get his contract off the books. If you could move J.R. Tristan, you could do that also. But I think they're going to be extremely hard to move. The reason why they're still on the team is because they can't trade J.R. Smith or a Tristan Thompson. So Kevin Love, he's going to miss some time, which will make it a little bit harder to move him. He couldn't miss up to a month is what we're hearing right now. But I fully expect him to come back and for him to be on the trading block. And I still think Cleveland, they're going to go ahead and just ring it in. Like This season is over for them. They're not going to make the playoffs. You might as well start looking to, towards the future and towards rebuilding. And that is going to start, at least in my opinion, with trading away Kevin Love. You guys let me know how you guys feel about this in the comment section below. Do you think Kevin Love will be moved before this year's NBA trade deadline? Or do you think he will stick around and maybe they will try to rebuild with Kevin Love as the focal point to this team? You guys let me know how you guys feel about this in the comment section below. It's your boy D. Lloyd. I'm going to see y'all next time. Peace.